Hi everybody. Uh, it's been a while since I've made a video because my camera has been uh, acting up a little. Um, this is still the same camera. It seems to be working fine right now, but uh, I ordered a new camera um, for. Uh, it, but it will be here, I think, uh, on Tuesday this week. Um, then I can start making uh, regular uh, videos again. The uh, thing is, I wanted to share with you uh, this one, so uh, I, th uh, I thought I'd uh, model through uh, uh, working with this camera for the moment. Because, uh, well, a while back I promised everybody I was going to do a giveaway. Uh, things got very hectic and uh, with the Christmas and, uh, and stuff. So uh, I didn't get around to doing that. And now I finally found the time to do something that I've been wanting to do for quite a while. Uh, I made um, a leather cover with uh, pyrography and, uh, and I, I painted a little on it. Uh, well, I used... Uh, uh, I accented, uh, accented the, the wolf's head. Because I've... Uh, I'm, well, last year, somewhere in March, I made a, a trial of this uh, wolf's head from uh, Game of Thrones. And uh, the writing, winter is coming. But um, that was just on a scrap piece of uh, leather. So uh, I've been wanting to put it onto a traveler's notebook and uh, just never got around to doing it. So now I did and now I made a cover and I thought that would be the perfect thing for the giveaway. So here it is. This is the giveaway. Uh, of course there are some uh, uh, things I'd like you to do to enter into the giveaway. I'll be writing a blog post to go along with uh, with this with this video and uh, and the post on my uh, Facebook page. And um, well, like I said, there'll be this video, and um, you can enter um, this giveaway by um, leaving a comment and liking uh, either on YouTube or Facebook or on the blog post I'll write uh, the rules uh, the rules for <laughs> the giveaway uh, in the blog post as well the thing is everywhere where you like and leave a comment uh, you'll have a chance to enter into um, the giveaway I'll do this with some sort of uh, online uh, raffle uh, thingy I have to check uh, out what works best and uh, then I'll uh, enter each entry over there. So if you have a Facebook one and a YouTube one and uh, a, um, a blog post one, um, you'll have three, three chances to enter. <laughs> so um, yeah, uh, let me show you what uh, what it is. It's it's a um, well, sturdy uh, leather cover, quite sturdy leather this one. Um, which is so the thing with saddle leather, it can sometimes be uh, very very soft and pliable and sometimes it's uh, a little more sturdy and uh, really uh, needs a lot of love and uh, well um, tenderness <laughs> to get uh, no not really tenderness just a lot of handling that's what does the trick usually um, it's this lovely uh, um, it's um, with English bridal this color and I've uh, added some uh, extra darker golden accents and uh, the wolf's head is um, let me see if I can get this in frame yes going in the right direction yes the wolf's head is uh, done with pyrography <laughs> I'm going out of uh, got my directions all wrong uh, anyway um, I haven't got very much experience doing this, so this was all new to me. Well, not entirely, because I did a try, uh, trial last year. But uh, I freehanded this. I didn't do much drawing actually beforehand. I just uh, started, uh, made a very tiny layout and then just started and uh, freehanded the lettering. Winter is coming. I don't even know if you can see that. Um, yeah, winter is coming. 
Well, I wish. I, I'd like some snow a little bit, but um, in other places maybe there is snow, but uh, not here. Just a lot of rain. Although yesterday the sun shone, so uh, that was good. But, um, uh, let me see if I can uh, show you what else I've got in this little giveaway. Um, let me see, there's well, the leather cover, of course. This is the back side. I, I distressed it a little um, with the with the burning tool, um, with a little stamping here and there, a few details. On, on my blog post I have some good pictures so you can really see what it looks like. And some darker paint dye actually, it's uh, transparent dyes these, so uh, I think it turned out uh, rather nicely. It's a um, sturdy leather as I said. So as you can see, it's a very um, nice piece of uh, leather. It's an extra large, regular size. So it'll hold quite a few more booklets than the regular size. As you can see, I have in here right now, I have uh, one, two, three, four booklets and a folder. Well, nothing in them yet, of course, so uh, it doesn't bulk up yet. Um, let me see what I have in here. First of all, I, I made a little field notes booklet, uh, just for fun. So uh, there's a little field notes bullet journal booklet um, with lines in this one, an index at the back. And then there's a diary for 2015. Let me see. Yes, 2015 with the months followed by notes so uh, I think you can get still uh, quite a bit of use out of this one so um, followed by uh, a diary well uh, this is an undated one but I made it last year which means there is a 2015 overview but there's also a 2014 overview which might not be so useful but then again it's uh, rest is undated, so you can still use this uh, with obviously obligatory flaps at the back because I like those. If you don't like them, you can cut them off. Um, a folder insert. Uh, stuck some doodads in there. All the nice pieces of paper with two pen loops. As you can see, with some embossed leather, uh, leather I had, which I thought was pretty. A nice color. I really think this is a very lovely color. And matches so well with, uh, with the TN, as you can see. <laughs> Almost the uh, same color. As does this booklet. This is a regular plain booklet that I... Uh, uh, well, normally I stamp a little on it, but I didn't know who it was going to because, well, if it if, if it's going to a man, I, I would uh, obviously choose a different stamp than when it was going to uh, a woman. So uh, in this case, I just left it off, and then uh, I, I can maybe do it later if uh, if you uh, when you win, you can still tell me. Oh, I'd like a little stamp, but that's okay. I can do that then. Um, and for now it's just plain like this it's a very nice leather it will become quite a bit more uh, pliable uh, in use but uh, for now it's a nice and sturdy piece and you can uh, use it to write on your lap and it, uh, it won't uh, bend the books or anything so uh, which I like so. Um, finished edges of course, nice and smooth, because I like smooth edges, uh, the little uh, tin clasp. Um, I tried something different, um, I have a, the elastics that I have at this moment uh, in this one are thinner than I would normally, um, yeah, there I am, <laughs> than I would normally use. But uh, I used, instead of two, I used four threads. So, which means you have four long and four short. And uh, for, the, for the little uh, field notes booklet, I thought I'd use even the short ones. And, and I 
Let me see, and there are three short ones. Uh, there should be another one <laughs> somewhere. So uh, one, two. Yeah, yeah I put both, uh, two both, uh, two uh, two long ones in here. But you can do what you what you like. And then um, the last one over here. Uh, let me see. This is the little folder I always add in with uh, my Traveler's Notebooks. It uh, explains a little bit about uh, the Traveler's Notebook, uh, about the system, uh, about the letter, about the sizes that are available, etc. Uh, the dies I use, it's, you know, all of those kind of things. And this is just a plain necklace. So, again, um, if you like this and you'd like to enter in the giveaway, just... Uh, Give me a like, either here on YouTube or on my blog post or on my Facebook page. Give me a like, give me a comment and uh, I'll enter you into uh, the giveaway. Uh, I hope you like this and uh, well, hope to hear from you uh, and uh, good luck in the giveaway. I'm off to uh, get my dinner now, so bye.